Hi Leo and welcome to your spirit guide messages for October 2019. I'm going to start by pulling a card for overall energy for October. It's like what's going on, what your guides want you to focus on. So let's see Leo what's coming out for all of you. Okay, Ooh, voyage. So it's all about movement, a journey, travel, relocation, starting a new job. This is really fun right here, Leo. This is good, good stuff. So let's um, dig right into that because like I said, that can mean many things. And at the, the full moon right there, we have the Aries full moon on October 13th. So maybe there's a really important trip happening around that time. Okay. Um, or movement. It's like trip, movement, uh, inner journey, a voyage of some kind for Leo and it feels good in this Aries full moon uh, bringing forth the manifestation of it oh. all right Leo let's pull some cards and see what angels are with you in October on this voyage or journey movement relocation okay so we have the angel of solitude Ooh, the Angel of Dreams. And lastly, the Angel of Challenges. Okay, so Leo, it is time for you to have some rest, have some reprieve, be recharged, restored, renewal. Okay, that's what I see going on with Solitude, Dreams, and Challenges, and then this voyage. So, this energy definitely um, could be like, Leo, if you have been holding off on going on a vacation or just taking some time off, October is a good time for you to do that To You know, do a staycation if you have some time saved up that you could use. It's like you really need um, some solitude and that doesn't necessarily mean um, away from people in general, like some of you could feel that way, but it's like there's some area of your life where you need a break from it, okay? You need to step away from it. You need to be healed and recharged and refueled and all of those things. So Leo, um, however that is manifesting for you, you need to allow it to happen or indulge in it, okay? This is a general reading, so you have to apply it where it fits. If your current living situations are not good for you, October is a time to move. It's like favored for you. It's very positive, okay? Um, if you've been thinking about moving to another state or another country for a brand new beginning, October may bring forth an opportunity or it may be time for you to start putting your resume out, you know, to different jobs in those areas that you would like to move to because, again, it, the energy is favored for you. So what I mean by that is um, like higher probability of success in movement, in vacation, um, also in starting an inward journey, okay, because we do have solitude here and voyage. So Leo, if some of you have been feeling like you really need to disconnect and get re in touch, like get re in touch, get reacquainted with yourself, really discover yourself. Like you feel like things have been changing internally, but like you're just been going along with your life, just your routine, the every day, the every day. And now October may bring where you need to really pull back, Leo, and spend some time by yourself. Really rediscover who you are because. Something quite significant has changed within you and in that, you know, journey, that voyage of learning self through October, and I love it because this is card 10, October is the 10th month, um, you're going to make a decision, a big sort of change, which is going to alleviate a lot of challenges that you've been going through, okay? So, Leo, October is really for you guys to be restored somehow some way and it comes through like a vacation a disconnection a break stepping back um disconnecting so let's pull some tarot cards and see 
you know what other information is going to come to light with this also pay attention to dreams repeating dreams repeating um, like reoccurring themes in dreams and as I'm saying that um, look at this the knight of swords fell out so as I'm talking about your dreams so these tarot cards are just about that let's see what do we have okay we have the knight of swords the page of wands and the six of swords so um, first and foremost this really truly Leo you need more sleep you need rest you need some sort of reprieve and um, if you've been resisting it like spirit is like Leo give yourself permission to relax to rest okay a hundred percent for sure like you need to and that's going to really clear your mind recharge your batteries and you're just gonna feel in a much much better place after something like that okay but um, also about the dreams you are receiving information okay so reoccurring themes repeating dreams the symbol like symbolism it's very important Leo that like you pay attention to that and you write it down upon waking like for the whole month of October I would really write down every single thing you can remember about your dreams because there is messages coming through for you like solutions answers clarity understanding um, if you've been asking like should I make this change should I do this should I do that your guides are answering in your dreams and um, you know giving you a solution that is very solid it's gonna lead you into like smoother waters more happiness troubles of the mind easing challenges dissipating okay so pay attention to dreams and also you know look up the meaning of different things that come through in your dreams and don't just stop at one source for answers really dig deep Leo there's a lot happening in dream time so let's pull some tarot for everything else All right, so we have, ooh, Leah, look at that. We've got the tower. This is definitely like a big change, a shakeup, a move, a movement. Um, if you've been thinking about like buying, selling your house, it, October is the time to really put the, you know, wheels in motion and get it started because, again, it's favored for that for you. Any sort of um, like relocation, highly, highly favored, uh, changing jobs, highly favored it's time for a big change also this here could be um you know you really pulling your energies back and going on this solitude journey through the month of october next out is the ten of swords yeah look at that you so need healing and rest and relaxation leo a big change like um, something in your life is just not working for you at all and it's causing you so much heartache and trouble and challenges that it's time for that to end like with the 10 you are done with that but it, it's like a big change a big shake up um, coming out of this 10 of swords next out is the seven of um, pentacles so this here you know you could be like, I've been trying, I've been trying, I've been trying, I've been doing and nothing is happening. I feel like I'm spinning my wheels. Like that's what this energy is about, Leo. Next is the Hermit. So I just have to say we have Angel of Solitude and we have the Hermit. So Leo, another confirmation of that downtime you need um, either completely like away from everybody or from a certain situation um or just to like f relax not work not worry about stuff vacation leo you need it it's like coming through times two now and with the ten of swords there ouch ouch like it's you need to be gentle with yourself you need to give yourself permission to feel what you feel to give yourself a break to give yourself a rest like Leo no momentum will be lost nothing will be lost through this like you need this recharge you need to be filled back up next out is the six of cups yeah look at that this is where you end which I like this is the restoration the return of innocence and sweetness and purity and happiness in your heart in your soul also, Leo, um, with the Six of Cups, it may be time for you to return 
back to your hometown, your home country, return to an idea, dream, or goal that you've had in the past that you let dissipate and die. Maybe it's time for that to be resurrected because the, the energy is finally here, Leo, okay? Um, also, this could speak of like a relationship, a connection of some kind, friend, family member, romance, where, um, you know, there's been this long period of separation between you and another person, whether you guys just lost touch or there's a bad falling out, most likely a terrible falling out. And now in the month of October, um, through dreams, okay, you could be getting information about this person or you may actually reconnect with this person somehow, some way. And through that reconnection, there's conversation, um, there's sharing of feelings, there's discussion and it, you know, could be to just give you guys the closure and the healing that you both need or it could be where you know it's a reconnection and you guys have this voyage together this new journey together where you know we were apart I'm sorry I go the wrong way where we were apart solitude separated now it's time to come back together and move on a journey together okay so for some of you that could definitely be going on but ultimately Leo your guides are saying to you Give yourself permission to relax, to step back, to let go, to do what's best for you. Spend some money. Um, you know, don't be afraid. Like, you really need a time out. Um, and if something is returning from the past, being resurrected, you know, it's either for closure or if it's an idea, goal, something like that, it's like it's time for it to birth into reality, to manifest physically. Like, the time is now. So let's pull some cards, Leo, and see what advice your guides have for you. <clears throat> okay, so Ascended Masters, create open communication. Divine Will, let go of fear. And lastly, we have light codes. Travel awaits you. Oh, is that not just the best confirmation from Spirit, Leo? Like, you need to go on a vacation, or you need a staycation, or you need to take a step back from a lot of people in your life, or a situation, or it's time to move or change jobs, okay? The travel, the journey, so highlighted for you guys in this reading, and I love that Spirit brought this out as the last card. Travel awaits you. Leo, yes, it is time for movement, and with light codes, and ooh, with light codes and ascended masters both coming out, um, this to me is that recharge, and through that recharge, like there's an expansion of consciousness, a deepening of connection to your soul, to your core, being more in tune and in touch with who you are, like that rediscovery, and now it's your desires, your wants, what's going to make you happy is coming back to the forefront and mattering. Um, you could have really been self-sacrificing for the greater good of something and it, it's just you're at the end of that, like the end of your your rope, like you can't go on that way any longer, even if it started out as a really positive thing or you're trying to do the right thing. Um, now the energy is shifting, Leo, and the focus needs to come back to you and what you need and what is good for you and it involves movement travel journey all right so let's pull a final card here and remember pay attention to the dreams okay information definitely coming through in dream time Ooh, leo this is the outcome healing chaos and you got the tower yes it is time for you to have that Ha, ah, I can relax, I can flow, it feels easy, the challenges are lifting, um, I'm feeling better, I'm connecting, I know what I want, I know what I'm going to do. Leo, beautiful, beautiful reading for October, definitely things turning around for you. Um, take a step back where you need to, give yourself permission, and it's time for you to relax and enjoy life, like seriously, um, to the fullest extent, to give yourself permission to enjoy, to relax, to do what you want to do, and make decisions that are going to suit you the best, regardless of how other people feel or what they think, okay? It's all right here, Leo. Make it about you in October, and um, any sort of movement, travel, go all in. Don't be afraid 
afraid to take risks, okay? Because these risks bring forth the changes that you so desire and challenges lifting, happiness being restored, all the crazy chaos, the disorder coming into alignment, a place of healing um, within you. So Leo, beautiful, powerful reading for you guys for October. All right, so those are your messages. I am wishing you all the best. Take care.